ってたかったんだよね、確かね。I mean, this be messing about in a, a house, some scrap bits, pieces of wood. I was laying some laminate flooring in my hall because I got rid of the carpet because I was fed up having to do it after I'd been doing something. So, just now I was just messing about in the, after laying the, the laminate, some little bits of wine boxes. made out of off cuts of uh, wine box and uh, just glued and nailed together and it's for salt and pepper olive oil whatever kind of condiments or whatever I'm just going to put that in a van so. just a wee quick one to show you that I just made out of some scrap pieces of wood nailed and screwed together took me about half an hour to make it And as you know with me, it's not, um, it's not about uh, perfection or anything like that, you know. Uh, so, it's just a little box. It'll do the job for what I want it for, so. See there it kind of slopes down. So I need to unscrew all the back here and then it's screwed. Next screw is up here. So if I can take all these screws out here, I can drop out the small small cut sections. And then, and then get up above the roof and there's this piece of wood in here, this strapping which is screwed uh, just just above the, the door opening. So I want to get in there underneath above the roof um, and unscrew this piece of wood, this strapping across here, goes right across. Um, unscrew that and I'll, I'll lift it up and I'll level the, the, the roof of the van out. That way I can get my cabinets up, if it's square I can get my cabinets up here in this part. Although I have to, I'm still deciding whether to build them out from the back to um, compensate for the slope of the van or do a scribe them to the wall in the van. So that's what I'm just trying to find out just now. Well, I'm taking <coughs> these screws out <coughs> and hopefully I'll get above that and sort that part. I'm still trying to figure um, to have them like, see like these ones, these ones are just Screwed to the roof and screwed up, screwed up through here, and screwed in through there. 
and then there's a batten screwed on the back of it to compensate for the angle of the van under here which then I just put on my little LED light so I could do the same over here because I'm going to get separate LEDs for this area so that I can just switch them on and just have them one of them lying in my bed reading a book or whatever you know I don't need to have all the lights on all the lights on so well, um, I'll plod on and see where I get to I'll go back to you once I get a bit further on what else? Changed my cupboards about. Changed all my ceiling. Just eventually um, describe them to all. So I think still do do what needs to be done just for storing clothes. So right deal. So there you go. Uh, gives me another few problems, so I've got I've got to do all this back, but anyway, but I damaged my ceiling up here, which I need to try and fix. And it exposes. This was all down to here. So we only had this little lip exposed to the metal. But now I'll need to. I'm going to carpet all this back part anyway, this. So. Go and do around that door and do the rest around that door over there. So, I'm too fussed about that. And I've got a space up here to do something with if I want. I quite like the fact that's the, like my headboard kind of thing, so um, I like the fact that I can, I can go up there and sit. When you've got cabinets up like that, you can't sit up. That's why I put them at the foot of my bed. So, got my TV to put back up. And I've got that bit down there where you can still see the bulkhead. I've uh, wire brushed it all. I've got Q rust in the garage somewhere. I haven't went and looked for that yet. I'm going to Q rust that and then just paint it all. And then I'm going to build something over there. My little uh, kind of caddy thing I made. This thing here. Just attached it on there. Just a couple of screws through there onto this part. And I've left it that kind of way because I'm going to see if I can build another one on top. The reason for it is not to really hold anything to be honest. I'll well, hold bits and bobs. The reason for it was just to try and cover this where the light gets out. So I covered it down there, so I need to build something here. That will just cut out that light, can I guide it? That can I guide it. Um, the Venetian blind when I'm pulling up and dropping it. So 
That is what I did with that little thing. Um, if you remember, I showed you I'd made another one of these. And I'll put this in here. It just holds. Just holds my cup. Okay. Um, magnetic things for holding my knives and stuff. But that, that does just fine, just for holding my knives and forks and spoons. I mean, there's only going to be two people in here at most, so I don't need to have loads of cutlery. So that was what I did with that. Another box of maybe something there, just a lot of shelves just now. So, where am I at the moment? Place is still a mid in. But I can see the end now, you know, I've only got. I've just got some, some wood I'm going to need to buy, I want to build um, I might build a little unit in here Just a tall little unit That comes no further than the, the, further than the, the width of the driver's seat So if we're about there to there And just that width There and over on this side, underneath my jackets and that, I'm going to build a, a box for my toilet. So what I'm going to do there is, I'm going to use this in some fashion. Whether it's to have another laptop. What I was thinking about is, Having a work top come across here, just this piece of work top, it's only like 300 wide, 310, something like that. I was going to have it coming across here, build a little unit there, and a unit over here with my toilet in it. But um, I would come out to here at the side of my driver's seat and have a hatch in it, like a bar flap, you know, in a bar, just to lift up. Um, just to get it so I can get from the back to the front because that's the reason I didn't box all that off is I like the fact that if it's raining outside and you pull up somewhere you don't need to get out to get back in the back you know it's good just to pull up come in through the cab. So anyway, that's where I'm kind of at the moment. And and my head's busting out now, so I've just got a few things I've got to do. I went and seen my brother yesterday <laughs> and I thought I'll go up and see him and he'll cut this work top for me and he's done his back in so I'm going to have to cut this work top myself which I'm not too happy about because I ain't good at it <laughs> Anyway, until next time Take care Ta-ra